Giants, Cowboys, big game for the Giants? Oh, yeah. Absolutely, because same as the Jets, do you really want to lose a division game and now you're 0-2? 90% right? of teams that start 0-2 do not make the playoffs. Uh, and again, it just it, it brings in that whole narrative of how much different you are than, than last year. You went 3-13 and last year. You make all these changes and now you're sitting 0-2. And, and I don't know if the Cowboys are really that good. They only scored 8 points against Carolina. Carolina's a good team. That was in Carolina, but they've got problems on their offensive line. The, the Giants have won in Dallas before in these types of situations. So do you really want to start after going 3-13, and 0-2? Oh and uh, yeah, the, we'll see what the Redskins do. Eagles already have a win. So you would be looking at going into week three. All of your divisional opponents will have already won a game. So you're behind everybody. All right, you're two you're two games into the season. The Eagles you're already you're already at least one game behind everybody in your division. The Eagles will be one and one, but we'll get to that later. It's a big it's a big week for them though, and there, and there's no reason to think that this isn't a winnable game. I'm sorry, I think we'll turn out that as this season plays out, Dallas is not a very good team. So this may be you never know, Don. This may be a game that when you look back on the schedule, goes. We had to get that one. You have to get the Cowboys games. We and don't I, know who that I, team is. I think you also fall into a here we go again. I really think you fall into that. Two straight losses. You played okay in the first game. You, your offensive line wasn't right. great, but you lost by five to a team that was within a half of going to the Super Bowl. Now Dallas is a three and a half point favorite. You so you get the three for being you get at the home. Three so for being at home. They, they think that these two teams are fairly even. And the Jets are three and a half over the Dolphins. And you saw that number moved because, as RJ said, before that game was played, it's probably a pick 'em game. Now everybody's excited about the Jets. Jets are in a tough spot too here. Again, not like the Giants because they would be one and one if they lost the game. But everything you feel about this team would be you'd be going back to zero again. A divisional loss at home, it would it would take away from what you accomplished against Detroit. Because what it really comes down to, because I think the Jets and the Giants are in a similar situation where they could be wild card teams, but you need things to go your way. You what the Jets did, they impressed everybody, they got everybody excited, but fundamentally it was a non conference victory. Your divisional games, your home games, they're very important. You don't want to leave a home game against the Dolphins uh, uh, with, 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 with a check on the right column. That kind of takes away really everything you accomplished in week one.